Hey guys, what is happening? It's iPad Ups everywhere. I have the Apple picked game of the week, and I was especially struck by this one because it's Rainbow Six, and I freaking love Rainbow Six. Um, so I had to pick it up. I think I do believe it's six bucks. I'll post the price down below. Um, but it's a it's a tactical shooter, and it's really interesting. And so this is the app of the week. I'll, I'll start doing this again because Apple actually does this on their little in their app store. They say you know app of the week or game of the week, and so I figure why not do it myself. Um, I'll review their game of the week every week. Um, so this is their game of the week for this week, Shadow of uh, Tom Clancy's Rainbow Six Shadow Vanguard. Pretty cool tactical shooter. So we have we have a campaign, multiplayer, co-op, and regular death matches. Very cool. Let's just go into the campaign. Let me show you. Oh crap. I guess we'll continue. I knew you were a quick study well, the voice acting I surprisingly is actually not half bad compared to other um, game loft shooters I've seen. Uh, nothing on Nova 2. Nova 2 is phenomenal. I really do like Nova 2. Uh, but Tom Clancy's is this you know, it's not too bad, not too shabby. Well, let's load it, load it. All right, Operation Steel Wing. Ugh. Oh, Steel Wind. Can't read that <laughs> through the camera. Okay, so what we got. Let me show you guys here. What we got going on is a very awesome layout. So up here we have the objective, and you see objectives so, um, also appear on the wall. Of the uh, of the in, during the game, which is very very cool, and also as you can see, to control your squad, you actually have these prompts on the actual environments that you can tell them to do, which is very very cool, and it's it's a new type of it's really interesting, it's really cool how they do it. I um, mean, it's a very typical shooter. You got your little uh, thumbstick over here. You got regroup. You got shoot to double tap. You can take off your silencer or put it on. The cover system is pretty well done. Um, they did a decent uh, decent job with the cover. Um, Let's just go in here, show you some cover. There you go, and you can pop out. You can see, rape their buttholes. Oh, ooh. I killed the wrong guy. Anyways, <laughs> this is a bad mission to do this one. Um, let's uh, go back to the menu and choose a different level, shall we? I don't know if the, uh, the brightness is a little too weird. I honestly, I'm still trying to figure out the stuff. Oh, I guess I haven't. What? What? No way. Oh, I oh I restart. No, there are no save slots, so you can't just. Darn it! Crap. Okay. Well, hopefully. No. Oh. I just overwrote my previous game. That's why I don't have any of the missions unlocked now. Which is very weird. Anyways, um, as well, like I said, the cover system's done very well. Uh, very intuitive. The the prompts on the wall that you can control your squad with uh, prompts on the wall. Very very cool. Um, and you can breach and clear. You can tell them to do all sorts of stuff. A very good, very good cover system and stuff like that. Um, typical shooter. You know, pretty good. Let's skip this. Pretty good aim assist. Uh, you know, decent sounds. Really, really overall, very very good game. Um, but I don't know for you guys out there who already have maybe Nova two. I'd stick with that for a little bit just because this price tag is a little high. Maybe it'll drop it down for some random holidays or something like that. Um, let's go, let's go. I'm trying to show you guys some gameplay. Listen up, Alpha Team. Alpha Team, your objective is to find the Alright, and the graphics they look fantastic too. Um, so we have a grenade here. Whoops. You have your objective here. Like I said, the controls are very smooth. Game Loft seems to really, really nail that down. So let's get into here. And you can see the prompts on the wall, very cool. So we gotta go this way so we can tell my squad to go there while I run. And we go here. Oh. Reload. Okay, get out of cover. To my squad to regroup. Oh god. Perfect, and you get XP for you know pulling off headshots and stuff like that. Very typical first-person shooter. Very cool. I've always loved Rainbow Six. Sorry for the glare. That's really obnoxious. I know. Oh my god. Getting killed, aren't I? All right. I'm good. Really trying hard to play this through the camera. Pretty difficult. Okay, so let's go up here. We gotta go this way. Gotta go this way. Tell my squad to go there. 
Slide over here. And again, so like, as you can see, it's a very, very smooth shooter. Um, it's as smooth as touch controls can get. Not too bad. They did a wonderful job with it. Um, nothing really to complain about there. They got a pretty long campaign, 11 missions, and each of them are pretty long, so you won't have a problem there. Let's go. I don't know if I should show you the multiplayer. There's co-op, which I've had some trouble with. The online play is decent. There is a little bit more lag than I've noticed in other game loft, uh, multiplayer games for some reason. Um, and it seems to just be awful connection. I don't know if it's me or not. Yes. And you, it's easy to find people. Uh, hopefully I can find it before the five minute mark. Oh, it's already five minutes. Crap. Anyways, you're going to have to take my word for that. For me personally, I've played a bunch of the multiplayer because I do love, I love uh, iPod Touch or iPhone multiplayer. Um, it's a tiny bit laggy. Depends, I guess, your connection and other people's connections. But what I've experienced is a little bit laggy. When it works, it works flawlessly. Same controls, same everything. Um, really great cover system again. So if you like Rainbow Six Vegas, Rainbow Six Tom Clancy games, this game is a game for you. If you already have Nova 2 or something like that, I'd stay away from this one for now until the price drops because it is a little pricey. Um, but if you do like this kind of third-person team tactical kind of deal, really great fantastic title, one of the best on the market right now. Let's uh, pull that out here. Maybe I should show you the multiplayer. Okay, I can find somebody to kill. And connection loss. So you can you kind of see where I'm getting from, uh, coming from. It's the connection's a little iffy with the online multiplayer, but hopefully they'll fix that with something. There you have it. That is Rainbow Six. I'll see you guys later. That is my girlfriend. I'll see you guys later. Everyone, remember to subscribe, rate, comment, do all that crazy stuff. See you guys around the next video. Peace.